first thing I said this morning. Uh, good morning, everybody. I am. I have a 9 a.m. That's why I got up this early. But I am already running late. Um, so I'll try and keep this brief. Basically, about a month ago, I got an email um, into my work uh, inbox. I, I have one of those asking if I wanted to, you know, feature on a like student radio thing. So I said yes. Um, and that is what today's vlog is. Uh, as you know, I'm not weekly vlogging, so this is like a daily vlog. I Have I ever done one of these? Mm, I don't know. So, yes, I'm going to be on student radio. <laughs> it's cool. I mean, an interview when you're 19 and only have 5,000 subscribers, I think is quite impressive. So, I'm very pleased with myself. As you can probably tell. Um, I don't know, I'm just really excited. Like, it's just, n it's just nice having the validation that someone else besides me thinks that me is worth interviewing, you know? I mean, you've seen my previous interviews with myself. They're like, blow, of course. It's gonna be on between six and seven, so when you see this, that would have been yesterday, but fear not. The, um, it goes up as a podcast afterwards, and that is gonna be linked below for you if you are interested. Um, so yes, uh, fuck my life. I only now have half an hour to get to halfway across London, so that's not gonna work. Great, and I brushed my teeth before I drank my coffee, so I'm using this as a prop. I don't know if I can actually drink this now. <laughs> Great. Great start. At least I smell nice. Boy in another life. I also think I was an 18th century aristocrat in another life. And now, magically, featuring I'm with you, Ellie. I don't think you can probably see me because it's very dark. Outside. Kind of, but the light but, on your um, face looks really cool. We're almost late. We almost. We're not, we're, we're not like fully late though. But almost is very important. Ellie's remaining calm because Ellie can remain calm. Highly paranoid and stressed. Yeah. <laughs> We, we left with so much time to spare, Ellie. Maybe the central line. Uh, so much time. Yeah, the central line was like hor horrendously oh. delayed. So it's it was not, not our fault. It's not my fault. It's TFL's fault. So exactly. there we go. Exactly. <laughs> the moment that's due to an accident no, which is causing delays. An accident which is causing delays back along the A11. And as far as things go at Notting Hill. I hate films and crossing. Ellie is keeping me calm. I'm keeping her calm, but I do have something in my eye. <laughs> Being late for things gives me like the worst like anxiety. Yeah, me too. Especially if it's like important things. Yeah. And it's really fucking freezing. Oh my god. Also, we asked the girl for directions how to get to this cafe. Um, she was very friendly if you watch it. <laughs> and, we were like, and we were like, yeah, we're not students here. And the face she pulled. Yeah. But like, it's one of those ones you don't realise you're doing. No, I know. Like, yeah, just one and you're like, she was like, it's quite funny. People get gassed though when you um, ask them to shut them around. Ellie is using her hair as a scarf. It's not really working. Cute. Press this button yeah. and it's filming. Fine. And then you zoom in like that. Fine. That's it. Easy. Ellie's filming. Is it is the red light flashing? <laughs> is the red light because <laughs> no, I can see because the time is on. Oh, okay, there you go. Ready and does it focus itself? Yeah, it doesn't automatically see. It does. Okay. Stem cells and Do you guys want to say hi to the vlog? Hey, how's it going? Hi. Should we Hi. No, it's fine. <laughs> I'm gonna put some Harry Styles because Emma likes Harry Styles. That's true, okay? I did put in a crest for Harry Styles. Okay. So 
So we've got Harry Styles going. It's just recording. Still more things. Yeah, just film. So the thing is, like, if I'm Ellie, you know, when I'm choosing a thumbnail, uh -huh. like, I just let it roll and then, like, do with it. I was saying that the mat wasn't so heavy. Do you want to sit down and just take the great chair? Yeah, take the no, chair. I'll take the one. No, but there are all the stuff. Not too many chairs. Well, you're blocking the shot, boy, man. <laughs> They're trying to take a vlog and your back's just in the foot. <laughs> Thank you, Ellie. That's the wrap. Face distance away and definitely into the mic. Some people get excited and they start to look at Sean while they talk and then they, it sounds like they're in the tunnel. Yeah, so it's yeah. important to talk into the mic. I, I sometimes have a mic on my camera and I've realised I move a lot when I talk. Yeah. So like that's why I just don't use it anymore. Cause like, that it's easy to really... do. It's easy yeah. to do. Oh, I do it all the time. So. Yeah, a lot of the smaller you... No, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Try now. Are you still rolling? Yeah, fine. Alright. So, is that microphone okay for you then, there? Yeah. The stand. I just want to make sure, I just want to make sure we can like, hear me. Yeah. My mum's on the radio before, so the first thing she told me was, Emma, articulate. Articulate okay. and, and, and be loud as well. Where? She's got a shock when I start speaking. <laughs> Welcome to the Retour Mendoza Show. You're listening to us live through Quest Radio, Queen Mary's official radio station. We have in the studio today, Sean. Hola. Hi, Sean. We also have Juan. I am your sweaty, sweaty host, Arturo, and we have a special guest also. We have a very special guest. We have Emma from YouTube. So Emma's a YouTuber. You want to introduce yourself? Hi. Hello. We've invited Emma onto the, onto the show to talk a little bit about her channel. Bye. Just, just say bye. Just bye. 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 Thanks for coming. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Yeah. Thank you for having me. Slugging in public. Pleasure. Yeah, I it's great. I've got a DS along, so. And if you need an extra for like an ogre in one of your films, give you a shout. <laughs> we are done. Ellie got a shout out and she went bright red. It was really good. No, Emma said I didn't feel as red as. It's okay. Thank you so much for coming with me, by the way. Like, I really, really appreciate it. It's like, I actually had a really good time and I was nowhere near as She was very good, actually, guys. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Ready, Emma? Oh, it's. So my hand sanitizer just leaked in my bag. Luckily in a side pocket. And in all honesty, I couldn't be more thrilled. It smells amazing. So it just, my, my, my bag smells really great now. And obviously it's hand sanitizer, it dries really quickly. So everything now smells of hand sanitizer. Uh, dinner and thoughts. So many, so many thoughts. You know, it was like, it was like two shots of me leaving the library. But there's a massive time difference between those two because like I think I shot one, then I went to I actually ran, I actually ran into two of the boys from my old school. One of them goes to my uni, the other one doesn't, but I was really, really good friends with him. So I was like, oh my god, hi! Um that was just really funny. Um but then I went to French for two hours, then I went back to the library, worked there for two hours, then as I left again to meet Ellie, I was filming, so it was like there's a jump cut basically between two shots of me leaving the library, but there's about a four hour time difference. So you know when YouTubers are like, yeah, I mean we share our lives, but not all of it, like that that's like you don't see everything like that's kind of what they mean by that being like two clips in exactly the same place. Several hours have passed since then. Um Oh my god, do you know what I did? Do you know what I did? Right. You may know I've meal prepped. Ah, so what I've done is I remembered to put the chili con carne to defrost in the fridge and not let, you know, take it straight from the freezer, stick it in the microwave and blast that for a few minutes. So I've... Oh, look at it. It's even liquid. So my level of adult has significantly increased today. Like, so much. Oh, I'm a little bit like... I feel I'm, I, I have like this thing, I often post shock about things instead of like during, I have like, once it's happened and I'm just kind of like, uh, okay, that just happened. I think I need to collect my thoughts. I'm gonna have dinner and collect my thoughts and then go back to you because that if you think about what I just did, I was just interviewed by somebody that is not me about my YouTube channel. What? Oh, what are you, like, what even is my life? I have Hingle.
Good morning guys. As I said I was gonna update you on my thoughts yesterday, but I really just fell asleep. I was so exhausted. I mean, 12 hour day? It's, not, it's a long day. I think honestly I just wanna say thank you to the Arthur Mendozo. Mendozo? I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Show for having me. Um, you know, for inviting me like that kind of has blown my mind that somebody like, you know, as I keep saying, somebody besides me thinks me is worth interviewing about like, you know, what I do and stuff. So I just thought that was really, really great. Um, and also obviously you guys, because I do you, you realise that the only reason I could ever do anything like this is because of you. So please never underestimate the power you collectively have, you know? It's kind of insane. And also like, um, this could sound really lame and sloppy, just bear with, but the amount of times I have imaginary interviewed myself. Yeah, so for this, so for someone else to interview me is like, yeah, you can see like why there's this like so, oh my freaking God for me. But I think just those are my thoughts like, Again, the first interview, age 19, about your work isn't exactly bad, is it? Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say. I'm just like, I think I'm like, I always, I always get like post overwhelmed instead of like beforehand. Like beforehand, I was just stressing about getting in there with Ellie. Oh my god, I didn't tell you guys. So, our way there, the point where we were going to go, we were going to get there with you know with the tube. The one time we need the central line. It's like trains are being held at stations for 10 minutes and stuff and it's like so packed and I was just like freaking out because we were going to be late and that was going to like ruin my life for me. These kind of, these kind of things give me huge, huge like anxiety. Um, so that's what I meant when I kept saying Ellie's basically being my therapist. It was because she was keeping me calm. She was keeping me so calm. Um, so we ended up getting an Uber there and obviously there was so much traffic because it was rush hour. So we were telling our Uber driver like, please. <laughs> Um, so he's like, it's okay, I'll take some like, you know, back streets for you. Um, and to be fair, he got us there like, he got us there on time, we we're only 10 minutes late, which was really good. Uh, yeah, so it was just a very stressful deal getting there. Uh, I was about to get to French, I did say, but then the tube again on the way back was a nightmare, so I didn't go. I tried. Mum, I'm sorry. It was really sweet though, because when my dad came home last night, he was like, yeah, mum and I were listening to it, we were in the restaurant, we were like taking turns listening to it. <laughs> You guys! So as I said, it goes up as a podcast as well. It is linked down there for you. Um, I'm just like, so I just can't really get over it, in all honesty. Um, it was also, uh, weirdly, like, during I was a lot less, like, nervous than I thought I was going to be. Like, if, if you know me personally, you won't really ever get this on camera. Um, but if you know me personally, you know if I get nervous, it comes out that word vomit. If I get nervous and I'm in a stressful situation, I talk incredibly quickly. Like, I'm sure you guys have gathered I talk really quickly anyway. So now imagine me with like, nervous verbal diarrhea. Yeah! Uh, but like, to say that didn't happen! I'm just really like, impressed with myself also because this is the kind of thing I maybe would have said no to. E not, even Emma of like, five, six months ago would have said no to this, so... Again, thank you for Ellie for coming with me because I don't, I wouldn't have gone, I wouldn't have gone without her. It's just weird. I'm like personal growth because you know how one of my like, was it one of my New Year's resolutions or one of my like, no, I know my New Year's resolutions was like follow through with creative projects. But what I kind of mean by that is like say, it's like say yes to more things, but also stop being a pussy about stuff. So those, those are my thoughts. I'm now late for my lecture. Yeah, I'm now late for my lecture. <laughs> I hope this update was worth it. Christ. Yeah, go give that a listen even if you listen to five minutes of it. So yeah, those are my thoughts on this like whole, it's really good. Also, they're really, um, the guys who like hosted it were incredibly nice. Their show is linked below. Then you know what the cutest thing was? My grandma didn't understand podcasts. My grandma didn't know what a, my grandma just couldn't understand what a podcast was. So we had to like, try, my mum was like trying to explain it to her. And then my grandma sent me a message like, hello radio star, I was like, you're just the cutest human being in the world. Um, so I think my main priority really is make sure that my grandparents, the three of them get a link being like, look. <laughs> um, I mean, my grandma speak very good English. Grandpa doesn't, I don't know if my grandpa even really likes English very much. So I'd like to think he listens to about 20 seconds of it. That's fine, find me. Oh, they're just adorable. My family's just been really cute about it. So, so yeah like subscribe and all that jazz and i will see you guys very very soon and now like you know 
Daylight, guys, is the worst to film with. <gasps> oh my god, did anyone see the sea moon? That was cool. I, like, Uber driver pointed out, I was going, look at the moon! I wouldn't have looked at the moon, I was so stressed. So yeah, that is the end of this story. Like, subscribe and all that jazz. I hope you've had a wonderful day. Um, and yeah, bye. Also sticky.